Well, we have an incredible uh, opening of a beautiful new barracks for our enlisted Marines, and it's part of a much bigger picture. The bigger picture is uh, how do we keep on assuring a great quality of life for our service members and their families. The common areas are very, very important because if all you have is just a, a room where you sleep and no place to really get together and relax and recreate with your friends or whatever you want to do, then that's going to be just a room. But this feels more like a home. And I think that's what, of course, what we're trying to do here is it's a home away from home. The ceremony was uh, phenomenal. It was great to see uh, Congressman Case here, as well as Colonel uh, Lyoness and Colonel Lightfoot here opening up the barracks. That shows that the leaders at the forefront truly do care about their Marines. Overall, I believe what these barracks do for our Marine is taking care of him here on base so that way when the time comes, they're motivated, they have uh, the belief that their leaders are willing to take care of them so they can do what they need to do and, and fight our nation's battles with the utmost professionalism and motivation. This replaced two barracks that were designed in the 30s, built in the 40s. So the Marines and sailors of, those, of that era thought they were the newest, jazziest buildings back then. Now with P901, the newest barracks in the Marine Corps. We have a generation of Marines and sailors in the 2000s that feel the same way. So much of the features in this barracks down to the materials that we use on the floor, flooring and the heads is the latest and greatest. So it is absolutely an investment in modernized things that will last for decades to come.